Genetics, how a particular breed processes information and how fast they react to it can be genetic. Look at your herders versus your sporting breeds. There's a genetic component to how we bred them and designed them to do a job. And because of that job, there are characteristics genetically that really help them do what they do. So let's take a sporting breed. Sporting breeds, by design in many cases, are looking for some type of bird or retrieve the bird for the hunter. So these dogs will generally have stronger memory because they need to know where the bird fell. Remember that location. When the hunter says go, they will go out, retrieve it, and bring it back to the hunter. That's just one aspect. There's flushers whose whole job is to run around, find, find the odor of the bird, lock in on it, hold until the hunter walks through and flushes the bird themselves or requires the dog to do that. And that has to happen in all kinds of different uh, conditions. So because of that, strong memory is important for these types of dogs. Herding dogs have to do what? They're designed to herd. Herd sheep, cattle, birds, etc., etc. That requires a dynamic ability to make inferences, to look at whatever it is they're herding, how to move them around, and adjust them to what the shepherd is looking for, right? So those dogs have to process information very rapidly, make quick decisions, and many of you with Malinois and German Shepherds have learned this, just in many different actual ways of how fast they will process information. Both the information you want to present to them and then the ones they make inferences on their own and start doing things that you're amazed how quickly you can train them to do things you didn't intend.